Hey guys, and welcome back to Absolute Love! My name is Twitchy, and we are playing this future Viking horror adventure! Last time we kind of went around and had a look at this whole entire place that we've been hang hanging out in. Turns out these are the roots of Yggdrasil, the world tree. The, somehow, somehow in the future, they found a thing and they've been bringing back all these myths and legends and they thought they could just study it, but they couldn't contain it. And now, for some reason, the people that caused the trouble can't fix the trouble. So me, a girl that just woke up on a tablet, a stone tablet with a robot poking out of her face, has to come and solve all these issues and solve them we will. Let's find out what this says, though. This is for Dr. Henrik Anderson, Dr. Brian Roberts. Operations Supervisor. Okay. Progress report on Evilheim Outpost N502. This is an outpost, is it? Moving along according to schedule. Procedures after the complete destruction of N498 are implemented. And what? What? The destruction? Building is strictly held to crevices. The amount of noise is held to a minimum. What? And outposts are working 24-7 to avoid the attention of the natives. The na How can you work to avoid attention? 48, that's a big number. Why were there 50 people here? Do you chill me to the core? To be fair, we're in the cold place. Like, honestly, this this whole area chills to the core. It is Niflheim, after all. Uh, can we touch it? This, this is weird. Can I? That's that's a nice light source. We want more of those. Am I supposed to be going this way? Uh, of course, with the robot prodding in my face, I've got this, like, F key. Uh, and this gives us some sort of weird spiritual sight. I'm a little bit worried about that. Other things that have happened. Uh, a demon ripped my arm off. You know, not, not too serious. Uh, I've got... Jagengrepper? Something like that. I can't remember the exact name of the uh, the arm he attached to me. Dr. Henrik Anderson, the guy that that message was for, uh, he, he came and saved me in big inverted commas. He, I was having some trouble with demons, it is true. Uh, but, you know, he was also kind of seems like he is... Uh, ultimately responsible for everything that's going on here. So whether he can save me from the thing he created, I, I, I don't know if that's really a phrase that I am behind here. I'm going very slow. Let's try and pick it up a little bit. I've spent the past three episodes literally crawling everywhere, but now, now I have this arm. Look at it. Ah. So we'll uh, we'll try and do something with that. That's the right click to aim. Oh, we got. Oh, gosh, look at it. What am I supposed to do about that? I ain't going to be able to zap that with my arm. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Though, funnily enough, not as terrifying as the spider demons. Uh, relatively terrifying, but that thing's going to just come along and like, kill me in one go. Splat. Whereas the, the spider demons, you know, that's, that's pain and torment and stuff going down. Let's, someone's knocked over a light here. Why would they do that? Is that thing still walking around? Wow. Okay, let's get a little bit of a move on. I'm trying to hopefully find some sort of uh, collectible out here. I don't know if I've missed many of them or not already. The, this is a collectible game. Though at the same time, mostly I find this game is just for walking around in. All right, I'm going to turn off my sight beyond sight and see if we can just... Follow the lighting here. Every now and then, there are bad guys hiding in the shadows. Movements. Not not keen on the movements. Let's not do that. All right, the wander on up here. Like it's just it's just it's just snow. No worries. It's just snow. Uh, what what will we be finding here? I don't know what lives in the cold. Uh, I'm not not too up on my Norse mythology. It has to be said. Um, but, you know, we'll figure that out. We'll figure that out. I, I'm aware of Odin. I was kind of aware of Yggdrasil before now. The world tree. But, you know, actual creation myths and stuff, I, I don't know. If I'm to be honest with you, I just don't know. Okay, let's carry on wandering down this way. Are we going to find anything? Uh, ooh. By an alternative route back to Midgard. Okay, Midgard is, of course, the mortal realm, the place where we came from. Uh, now, I don't know if you guys are oh, aware of how these... I was about to be like, hey, we can we can bust this open using my new special powers, but it turns out it was just a door. Okay, we've got a ladder there. Anything I need to be aware of, let's just turn that off and climb up the ladder here. Uh, never keen climbing up the ladder without my... Uh, spirit vision on the go. I don't know what we're actually going to call that. I'm going to go with spirit vision. Uh, mainly because I just, I can't see, and I like to be able to see. Are we now in, like, some sort of serious lab? 
Or, like, admin area or something. What was that on the floor? Kram. I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to read that. That's a, is that a 2 or a Z? Who knows? Who knows? We've got a, a door we can unlock over there, but I want to get this soul stone first. It's not a soul stone. What do they call it? Soul shard? Something like that? I can't remember. Exactly. Let's take a moment to look out the window here. Wow. Wow. It is cold and desolate. And also, still, no people. Why is it that... Oh, I thought that was a person there for a moment. Why is it that uh, Mr. Henrik Anderson uh, is, and his wife, wherever she is, the only people that exist. Is this where I came in from? Is this actually where I came in from? Or did I crouch? No, okay. Cool, cool. Look, there's more there. There's more. Hey, can I get a drink? Can I... Can I it's, it's a lime and something. I, I would really like that. Lime soda. That would be great. I think I just let out a pulse by accident. I didn't I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Let's grab that. There was also another thing over here. Oh, a new charge crystal. Yes, please. We'll press that button to open it. You can see that they've given us a thing inside there. This goes into my arm. You can see how I've now got three cells. That's pretty cool. Two of them are dead. Oh. He's breathing. You get this? Yeah. Oh yeah, we're here for the key, aren't we? This close to finding it. I, but the road home, I, I can't get to it. Not with that. Not with that thing. Outside. Wow. I, 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 Is that the road home? I don't know how much more of this I can take. You have to send someone to find another route. There are Maybe loads of routes though. Oh, buddy. Oh. Oh, I'm, I'm not impressed with how, how Dr. Henrik Anderson has been treating his men. Now, he tells me that going to find this key is the only way through. I, I really feel like this has got something to do with what we're doing here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can, we can legitimately pulse this, can't we? Um, let's go get a full charge again, and then we'll figure out how to open that up. I think we just press and hold again. It's been, it's been 24 hours since I was playing this game last, so uh, I'm just going to take a little while to remember how to do it. If uh, we do that and get a pulse going and then go pop. No. Okay, all right, that's not the way. That's not the way. Okay, we've got a, got a new problem to solve here. We can't see anything on the on the old sight meter here. There, There is this on the floor, but I don't... I don't see how it relates, honestly. There was another thing somewhere. Let's go and have a look. There there was a bit of writing on the wall somewhere. Uh, let's get another charge just in case because I have been depleting it. Here's the writing on the wall and here is the way through. Maybe we can pop that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's the way forward. And then I can also look at this. Pop that. Bam. Nice. All right. I want to go back and get a charge though. Oh, there's no way I am leaving here without full charge. Just just not gonna happen i would like to know what type of energy source they reckon this is it's probably like some sort of ethereum energy or something like that but uh yeah i'd like to know i'd like to know all right having a look around what do we see we've got another door over there there's another door mechanism over there there is a way out um let's see if we can just go did you see those shinies there oh look shinies um let's let's have a look outside the door first let's see what's going on i've got a feeling this is actually a way to climb out up and out uh, so that guy says he knows where the key is. The key is what I'm here to look for. So if we could find that, that'd be great. Is this, is this the door? No. Oh, wow. What am I supposed to get from all this? I never know. I never know. I don't I don't read runes, unfortunately. That is a, probably actually a big holdback. Probably a big holdback. I could see that uh, being really, really useful set of skills in this game. Oh, okay, let's have a look and see what we've got up here. I mean, I've... I feel like the jump for safety might be a winner. Okay, this is where I'm supposed to go. I was, I was totally going to jump over there. Um, once again, a small fall from the start, from the height of my body was enough to give me the red outlines to my vision. Not overly keen on that. Uh, am I not allowed to use that door? It turns out that I am not in any way allowed to use that door. This guy, though, I just need to click it when the thing's up there. So, ah, I missed. Oh, wow, I totally missed. I did this so well last time. There we go. Okay. Did you also notice how it slowed down? I noticed how it slowed down. It's almost like they made it easier when you messed up. Okay. In here, we have toilets and stuff. Why Why am I... This is a thing that I've been following around. This... Oh, hey! Collectible found. I mean, that's great. 
Does this mean I'm not on the right path? <laughs> is, that, is that what we're saying here? This is just a little bit of a... A hidden room, a special secret. Oh, that's a little saddening, actually. A little saddening, if that's the case. I really thought I was on to the actual storyline. On in these. Um, I have to turn those off. Just want to see for the, for the sake of seeing, you know. Yeah, we can open this one as well. No, this one. Ah, it's, it's lodged shut. That's the problem with that one. Okay, cool. Can't open any of the. Which ones do we reckon are going to actually have some stuff? Ooh. <clears throat> hey. You, uh, you, you got a thing there. Ah! Yeah, we're going to take that. Okay. Find Aspeloff key in Niflheim. And that's, that's it. That's the key. We got, we got the brain. That's good enough. All right. What is. Oh, and the RFID for number two. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, so we we done this one. Let's get get on out of here. I'm sure we're about to have horrific run-ins with some bad guys, right? That that's got to be the thing. I really want to be able to get through there. It quite annoys me that there's a spinning thing that I can't interact with. Okay, so we we've got the thing, and now we need to try and make our escape out of here. That should not actually be any sort of issue whatsoever. What is clothes everywhere? I would like to see. A body or something you know like there was a there was a whole a whole crew here and now there's just me walking around and some writing on the wall uh this i'd like to know where they went where where's the guy who lost his feet no that's that's not what i want please please leave ladder so yeah where's the guy who lost his feet this this is a question uh can i get a recharge please uh, there's also, yeah, that tab to display systems. It seems like a good plan. Let's do that. Okay, so we can see we've got the RFID 1 and 2. We've got the key to the Niflheim. We need to find an alternate route back, but return with, with key to the to uh, Dr. Henriksen. That's that's where we're at, thankfully. Okay, let's try and find our way out of here. I, I, I am leaning towards jump... Oh, wait, we've got a new door. <laughs> I forgot about that door, if I was to be honest. I was going to, like, climb up and jump out. Uh, but look, we, we've got this now. So that's all good. That's all good. Let's take it back off here. Anything going to happen? No, all right. I was a little bit worried that something was going to happen. Let's crouch and lean out. I, I, th I still feel like these leans are, are useless. I still feel like the leans are useless. I, I also feel like the crouch is useless. Ooh, you see that just down there? Looks like an elevator control. Let's go and have a look and see what we've got over here. This is another door. I'm going to use the door before we have to uh, pass it by. Crouch. Prepare thyself. Okay, it looks like we're good. It looks like we're good. Is this just a dead end? Might be. Might be. I'm going to grab that little charge uh, capsule there. Uh, this is good. I also want to have a look in here. Oh, give me those crisps. Oh, it's been so long. Uh, you know what? Me as a character, I've not, I've not eaten since I was revived resurrected by the rope i i assume that i was a human to begin with right that different things seem to recognize me particularly dr henlick and his wife seem to recognize me as alice even though they're like that's not alice it's a construct um so i i don't know i don't know i feel like me i feel like me um but i don't i don't know whether that means i am me i mean that there's the real question you wake up and you feel like you is that good enough is that is that is that resurrection achieved i i like to think so i i know the me that got left behind and did do the dying probably wouldn't think so but the new me and even the old me that did the dying would appreciate that the new me is going around oh okay i thought oh i thought everything was rising up around us for a moment there but no no it turns out we are dropping down uh, there was noise. The elevator's kind of stuck. Okay, there's a lot of um, one-way access ways here, I know. We're, oh, look at the dragons. Nice. Yeah, they're, they're really keen on me not backtracking in certain places, which, I, you know, I am kind of all about. I like it when a, when a game dev doesn't let you get too lost, though I do also dislike a bit of railroading. Uh, okay, let's uh, just have a little little shafty look in the in the corners over here you never know there might be another collectible turns out probably not 
but that's that's the thing so Niflheim lots of water around I know I know it's in the form of snow but you know it's uh, despite the fact that it's cold it is a very water rich environment so you can definitely see why this hands here let's hear that I hear that I'm super worried I know that sounds a little bit like hey I'm super what? What? How? Did anybody see any marker that said, yeah, now you're going to get gone? I, I just, I, what? Just what? All right, hey, we're back in the maelstrom. How you doing? Um, so, I would normally expect to be putting things in there. Last time we were here, there was two two little nodes, and we picked them up and we put them in place. In fact, one of the nodes was already in place. I assume now we've got a little bit of a, a hide and seek, a hunt for the item, that sort of thing going down. See that over there? I see that over there. Let's try and work our way around. Look, here's one. Okay, grab it. Now let's go and pop it over here. I don't know what's... Uh, do we need to do that for both? I assume so. Okay, so that's one in place. Uh, let's go back out this way. I don't see anything being like, ooh, you can come over here. Ah, oh, there's only one. Is that good enough? No, I can't. We can't jump in. All right, let's go for a bit of a look around. Unfortunately, I think it is literally a case of just walking about. Oh, there it is. There it is. It was literally just a case of walking around and trying to find it. I, I had a feeling that it was going to take a little while, so hopefully I did a nice little jump cut there. Either that or you guys had to listen to uh, awkward silence as I walked around the corners a little bit. You know, that, that's all fun. I hope, I'm hoping that I was on the ball enough to uh, do, the, do the edit as it was needed. All right, let's try and find out what it was that got me. We heard it. We didn't see it. Okay. All right. This this is a checkpoint here. Okay, cool. So it came up and over there. We were wondering... What? I am a little bit confused about that. Okay, next time we land, we're just going to stop and look around. Okay, the new tactic is just to run around the... Out Extra bad guys? I didn't realize that they were going to be here, to be fair. Wow, suddenly... Suddenly we got big... So I, I, wow! I'm shocked, actually, guys. I didn't realise that that was going to be uh, a, a way to die. I didn't realise there were going to be bad guys in there. Shocker. Horror. I wonder how I deal with them. They haven't really given me any training for this. I, I have to say. I have to say. Oh, man. Really? All right, let's run. Oh, actually, kind of good. Kind of good. I just had a look in my inventory. I've got the key already. Okay, that... That saves me having to run around and find out what was going on. Let's uh, let's just go through and do all these. I so I wonder what was I supposed to shoot? What am I supposed to do? What was the what was the actual key to what I was supposed to be doing there? I I, I don't know. I don't know what the difference was between the first walk arounds that we did. Maybe like being all quiet and stuff really does have a an impact on the game. I was kind of thinking that it didn't. If I was to be honest with you, uh, I was kind of thinking that actually, you know, this horror game is all about putting myself in the uh, in the state, not 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 uh, not letting the game do it for me. But it turns out there are actual reasons to be scared of what's going bump around here. Okay, let's press this. Here we go. All right, we are back in the lift in the elevator. We are going to make our way out of here. I'm going to then. But there he is. I'm going to just kind of stand still for a moment. See that now? Oh, I see. That is his vision. Ah. Things that I missed when we first turned up here, eh? Are you literally just going to carry on looking like that? Is there is there any... Is there any way to predict slash avoid this? I, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'm going to go over here and just it down under this uh okay so now that we're watching out for the light we should be able to avoid it now now that i know it is actually a thing wow no 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 i totally wasn't moving how dare you? okay so it is it's not even a uh, uh not even a don't move it's a just don't even okay fair enough Okay, so the plan this time, we're in the elevator, we're going down and he's just about to stick his head up and over the top, is to try and find areas of shadow. I'm going to take a little moment to watch out what he's doing. You see how he looks up here and then 
He looks over there. I'm not sure if this is like a standard pattern, but I'm going to watch it for a second and see if this is the pattern. Down, up. I just, I don't know whether he's got a random view or whether it's actually some sort of pan. Yeah, back up here, look. So when he goes down, he goes over there and back over this way. And then he should go over there. Maybe up a little bit now. Uh, yeah, no? okay, over there. And then he's going to go back down here. And then he's coming up here next, right? Okay, we've got the pan. We've got the pan. Now he's going to go over there and we're going to move. Ready? I'm stuck. Ah, all right, go, go, go. Uh, can we hide here? I think I'd prefer to hide in the box. Oh, oh, oh go, 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 go. We, we know the timings here. We know the timings. We've still got that horrible little crunchy noise, but that's fine. Okay, there's, there's his eyes. It's going over that way. All right, time to run. Time to run. Time to run. Time to run. Okay, we found the pan. We used the pan. Oh, we are out of here. Oh, buddy. Whoa, buddy. Okay, that took far more attempts than I'm probably even going to show on the video, but that that was more than slightly scary. Okay, cool. Nice. Is that the route back home? I hope so. Is that something to interrupt with? I don't... I just... I just don't know. I'm just... I'm getting out of here, guys. Is that... Is that legit the route? Get out of here, please. Like... Nab him. Zap him. Be like... Bzz, bzz. Okay, all right. All right. Fine. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I literally don't know what this game's going to be throwing at me next. So here we go. Let's let's go. I'm going to assume this is going to Midgard, right? I'm just going to I'm just going to go. Just going to go. I'm not I'm not even going to hang around because you know what? Ah, death do with destruction. And welcome back to Midgard. We're going to have a weird little loading lag there. What is that? Hey, how's it going? Uh, I assume this uh, visual effects up here are uh, interfering with me. Okay, so we found an alternate route back to Midgard. By the gods, is that you? Who? Who's talking? Back alive. As soon as we lost connection, I thought. Where are you? I can see you on a camera feed. Where? Ahead of you, in Absolov Research. There's an elevator that you can take to me on floor B1. I've marked the elevator so you can find it with your sight. Find it with my sight. Research, but don't stay for too long. Don't insert the key into the tablet until I've analyzed it. Okay. I I will not put anything in anything until you tell me it's time to go. But that said, I'm going to touch this and say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time. We're going to go find out where that elevator is, give him the key, find out what that's doing, and probably get sent to some other realm to find another key. But I will see you then. Well, we're gonna do that. Bye.